Okay, so here we have silkworms. Um, so first, they're going to be very small. And when, when they're very small, I, I used the uh, a tissue box. I just cut the top and I placed them inside with mulberry leaves, of course. And when they grew larger, I changed them into a Jumbo Freezy, jum Mr. Freezy Jumbo Box. Um, because they need more space. And once they grow bigger, they're going to eat a lot. So at one point, they're going to stop eating. And they're going to turn yellow and kind of clear. Well, not yellow, but shiny and kind of clear. Like this one. The one right there. At the bottom of the screen. I don't know if you can see, but... Uh, Yeah, right there. He's upside down, and he's actually cocooning now. You can't see, but there is silk strands. And he's actually spinning out the silk and making silk. And this, the cardboard here, this thing, it's for the cocooning. So they will climb on like that one, and they'll make their cocoon. So as they grow, they're going to make the cocoon, and yeah, once they make the cocoon, oh, and by the way, this is poo, so I use it as a fertilizer. Um, once they make the cocoon, they're going to be like a white oval shape. Like, I haven't um, made my cocoon yet. I mean, my, <laughs> my silkworms haven't cocooned yet. Um... Once they cocoon, it's gonna they're gonna be moving inside. So when they are moving, don't take them off. When they're when the cocoons are white, pure white, um hard, well you wouldn't know it's hard, but they're white, perfectly oval, you can take them off and make sure no nothing's moving inside and just put them on a piece of white paper. Because once they come out, they're going to spit out a liquid. And you don't want that in your, on your floor or anything. Or in your box. And I'm using a box because I don't have a really big plastic container. But plastic would be the best. And yeah, when they start to hatch... Um, they're going to start mating. And then they're going to put their butts together. The male and the female, they're going to put their butts together. And, yeah. So the poo, I mean, not the poo, the eggs, they're going to be black. Like the poo, but the eggs that are not fertilized from the male um, will be yellow. The ones that are, are black. So you're going to keep those eggs not refrigerated, but warm. And, yeah. So, did I cover everything? Yeah, okay. And then the eggs will hatch. And then they'll come out, and then they're going to be really small, really small. And you can put them in this kind of thing, or a plastic container. Which is the best. And yes, and I said before that they only eat mulberry leaves. Um, if you don't have mulberry leaves for, I don't know, for any reason, you can't, you can give them a, um, carrot, like the leaves of a carrot, the top, or dandelion leaves. Not the petals, but the leaves. Um, so like, yeah, the leaves. So they are actually going to eat that for hydration, but only use it as a supplement. So don't use it randomly. Only use it if you have to. 
And yeah, as you can see, this one's still making the silk. I think you can see the silk, but like there's a lot of silk. And yeah. And one more thing. Um, I don't know what type of silkworms these are. So it would be very helpful if you leave what type they are in the comments. And you would also leave questions in the comments too. Uh, I'll show you the silkworm. One silkworm, this one. Uh, wait, I'm not sure which one. Because they... Yeah, I'll take this one. Come on. Come on. Come on, I won't hurt you. Okay. Oh, it bit me. It bit me. Look, I'm not going to do that one. Because it just bit me. Okay, yeah. Just bit me. Um, Maybe not that one. Let's dig this one. So this one, it's you can see. Don't bite me. Okay, so there's black dots on the side, and on the head there's nothing, but on the back there's this spike on the butt right there. And that is brown, there's dots on the side, there's nothing on top of the head. And yeah, so please tell me what type they are, it would be really helpful. And if you have any questions about silkworms, just leave them in the comments.